Hey guys, my name is Scobie. Today I'm going to be showing you how to add custom playing options in Discord. This is going to be a nice quick and easy tutorial. This is something you'll see on a lot of servers if there's a lot of people there. Some people will be playing really weird items that aren't real items. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to set this up. So the first thing you want to do is open up your Discord client and you can open up any channel. This will be global on Discord, so don't worry, it's not going to be specific channel only. Once this is done, we're going to be coming down to our profile on the bottom left. We're going to be clicking on user settings and then our user settings window should pop up. From here, we're going to be looking for game activity. And this is going to be showing a list of all currently available on screen games that show up in your discord. Now, in this case, it's not that we can edit or change any of these default games as these are already set up. But what we can do is add a custom game or application and then give that a name. So what we want to do is click not seeing your game. Click this edit button right here. And then this little window will pop up where we can drop down and select any currently running applications that we want to show up in Discord. In this case, we're going to be using Google Chrome as an example. Click add game and then Google Chrome will be added to our list. Now, if we back out of here and we look at our name, we should see that we're currently playing Google Chrome. Now, what we can do is actually take this one step further and rename Google Chrome into anything we want to change. So what we're going to be doing is going back down to our user settings on the bottom left. We're going to be going back to our game activity. Then if we hover over our custom added game, we should see this light edit box coming up around it that we can click in and actually edit. So what I'm going to be doing in this case is renaming Google Chrome to something else, something like tutorial simulator 2018. Once you're happy with the name you've changed, all you need to do is click away from it and the changes will be automatically saved. From here, we're going to be clicking escape. And if we come back to our name on the right, we should see playing tutorial simulator 2018. And of course you can do this with any open application. And if you find a really, really light application that doesn't take up much CPU or Ram, you can set this up and leave it as your default kind of running in the background thing. And it can always be your selected one. Anyway, guys, it's that easy to add a custom application and change the name on it in discord. If you guys enjoyed this tutorial, be sure to drop a like. Subscribe if you're new, check out the other videos on the channel. I'm going to be leaving a link down below to my PayPal if you found these videos helpful and you want to support me. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. Until next time as always, keep it saucy. Peace.